Hi, good afternoon, everyone. Okay, uh, so recently, because uh, city intimation slip tha, admit card tha, us samay we all forgot ki jo final date hai, jo bhi universities hai, jo finally CUT ka part hai for 2025, unka jo last date tha, that was 7th of March, which was last Friday. Thikha, that was the cutoff date, jaha tak uh, jo bhi universities thi, jo who wanted to participate, in CUT PG 2025, they had to kind of register and be listed on the CUT portal. Okay? But of course, we were busy with the city intimation slip and of course, most importantly, the admit card. So we couldn't discuss the final list of universities which freeze hai, close hai for 2025 PG entrance exam. Okay? So let's go ahead and see all, which all universities are there for your CUT PG Economics 2025. That is the final list. No more addition uh, even on the website because the cutoff date was 7th of March. Okay. For easy navigation, you can go test paper pe ja sakte ho so that you get exact universities for your exact universities. Mile. Of course, you can go to university wale section pe bhi ja sakte ho and then scroll for your subject. But I would rather prefer test paper and then CUQP 10. Okay, which is your paper code, right? Now, here the universities are, they are specifically includes CUT, PG, uh, economics uh, for their admissions. Okay, there is no other university outside this. Of course, uh, it doesn't mean that no other university can do your CUT score except nahi kar sakte. Okay, these are the universities who are officially listed on the CUT ke website. Pe. So, these are guaranteed sure shot that they will be accepting or their admission ka criteria has to be via CUT. Whether it is 50% or 100% or whatever, that is a different thing altogether. But all these listed universities will have to take admission via CUT PG score for sure. Along with that, because even though cutoff date is over, so you will not get major update if they go by their own notice. Lekin, which universities hain, jo shayad yahan pe list na ho, lekin they will or they might also be accepting your CUT PG score. Theek hai? So that remains to be seen. Aapki jo bhi preferred university hai, aap wahan pe ja ke uska admission process dekh sakte ho ki along with their own entrance exam, they are accepting CUT as well or not. Theek hai? So a quick navigate karenge through the universities. Theek hai? Jo bhi mujhe main main lagenge, I'll just uh, call out their name. And then, of course, what are the top five, top ten? That is, that is for a separate session altogether, so that we can discuss in detail and that too in a sequential order. Okay. So overall, if you see uh, in this particular option, we did discuss about Dr. B R Ambedkar University, Delhi, which is based out of Kashmiri Gate, Delhi. Okay. Then we discussed about IP University, Guru Gobind Singh in the first university again, Delhi. Okay. Then uh, Dr. B.R. Ambedkar School of Economics University in Bangalore. Okay, it's been like, uh, if I'm not wrong, six to seven or eight years approximately for this particular institution to be up and running, which was inaugurated by our Honorable PM, right? And uh, Mata Vaishno Devi University because a couple of, look, students come from across the country, okay? So, our region may put students a particular preference. Hoti hai. So, when they ask a query, so that is kind of there in my mind. So, I will call out those universities as well. So, if you have a particular region or area, se ho, then you have this option to, to look at it as well, okay? And over here, you have uh, University of Chambu, okay, DTU, okay, DTU we did discuss, key DTU is again this year as well, is part of uh, COD process, again based out of East Delhi, uh, in Delhi, okay. Uh, ta -da 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 -da. Okay. And then of course, University of Delhi, which is the highlighting or the main institution, which you all target, okay, all universities but of course, each one of you has 
Delhi University as its primary goal, his or hers primary goal. Okay, so DU is of course there. Then, if you have noticed here, you have multiple central universities. Her son, because. अभी डी ने ज्वाइन किया उससे पहले जे एन ने ज्वाइन किया उससे पहले यूनिवर्सिटी ऑफ हैदराबाद ने ज्वाइन किया बट बिफोर लेट्स से फोर फाइव इयर्स बैक ओनली द मेजर सेंट्रल यूनिवर्सिटीज वर पार्ट ऑफ सी तो अगर आप यहां पे नोटिस करोगे यू हैव ऑल द सेंट्रल यूनिवर्सिटीज पॉसिबल चाहे वो सेंट्रल यूनिवर्सिटी ऑफ हिमाचल हो तमिलनाडु हो राइट इवन यू हैव पंजाब कर्नाटका सो ऑल द सेंट्रल यूनिवर्सिटीज आर पार्ट ऑफ सी यू टी पी ठीक है देन ऑफकोर्स अगर आप यहाँ पे नोटिस करोगे अपार्ट फ्रॉम द सेंट्रल यूनिवर्सिटीज राइट यू हैव हाईलाइटिंग पॉइंट विच इज जे एन यू राइट सो अलॉन्ग विद डी एस सी सर्टन स्टूडेंट्स हु वॉन्ट टू गो फॉर सिविल्स और वॉन्ट टू गो इन रिसर्च वर्क दे यूजली हैव इंक्लिनेशन उनका प्रेफरेंस रहता है टूवर्ड्स जे एन यू ओके देन ओवर हियर अगेन ऑल द सेंट्रल यूनिवर्सिटीज बट अनादर इंपॉर्टेंट वन इज योर पॉन्डिचेरी यूनिवर्सिटीज जो काफी बच्चे From the southern side, they usually target Pondicherry University. Okay. Okay. Then, of course, University of Hyderabad. Wow. Four, five years back, the main or the top-notch in, uh, institution was there. Like now, the Delhi University or the DSC, whatever you want to call it. Earlier, University of Hyderabad was the highlighting point of uh, CUT, right? So, again, again, a very reputed institution. You can target that as well. Now. Uh, Out of this particular section, I would rather highlight BHU. Okay, BHU is still, of course, it's one of the oldest universities, highly recognized. So, काफी सारे बच्चे are still inclined towards BHU. I know you have multiple options, but ठीक है, BHU is something that you can still keep as a backup. But you have still better option than uh, these universities. So yeah, of course, you have BHU also as one of the uh, top options, right? Uh, then of course TIS, TIS is over there. Ah, uh, TIS may if I as far as I remember they don't have core economics. ठीक है. So that is something remains to be seen. Then you have Terry, Terry School of Advanced Studies, right? And of course then you have Gokhale, right? Symbiosis added this year. ठीक है. So this is the first time for Symbiosis School of Economics. Uh, over here, more or less, are these private universities? Do, 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 do. Okay, Azim Premji University, both Bangalore and the Bhopal campus is there. You have JP in Noida, lovely professional university, got limelight last year because of their uh, percentile tracker. ठीक है, CUT का percentile tracker था उनका last year, so that's where they got a lot of recognition last year. And then lastly, all these three IGDR, CDS, and of course some, right? So mota mota, this is your final list of institution. Is me koi or change nahi ho sakta as per their own notice, which says seventh of March is the last date of registering, uh, of registration of universities via CUT. ठीक है? Again, that doesn't mean ki koi or university apka CUT ka score nahi accept kar sakti. Of course, they can accept. वो उनके एडमिशन प्रोसेस के ऊपर डिपेंड करता है ठीक है सो दिस इज जस्ट छोटा सा एक ब्रीफ कि आपकी लिस्ट फाइनल हो चुकी है एंड सम ऑफ द रिनाउंड नेम्स आर सो एंड सो राइट टॉप फाइव टेन वो जो रैंकिंग होती है दैट इज फॉर सम अदर सेशन लास्टली अनदर इंपॉर्टेंट पॉइंट आई वॉन्ट डिस्कस इन दिस सेशन इज रिलेटेड टू जामिया यूनिवर्सिटी एम इकोनॉमिक्स बिकॉज बहुत सारे स्टूडेंट्स की क्वेरी है कि वेन इज जामिया स्टार्टिंग देयर एडमिशन प्रोसेस फॉर पी जी एंड ऑल्सो वेदर इट्स पार्ट ऑफ सी यू टी और नॉट सो ऑफकोर्स टू कन्फर्म जामिया इज नॉट पार्ट ऑफ सी यू टी फॉर एम ए इकोनॉमिक्स ठीक है सर्टन कोर्सेज हैं जिसके लिए इट इज पार्ट ऑफ सी यू टी बट नॉट फॉर एम ए इकोनॉमिक्स जामिया इज नॉट पार्ट ऑफ सी यू टी फॉर मास्टर्स इन इकोनॉमिक्स कोर्स ठीक है अब आप जो भी बच्चे वॉन्ट टू नो द इन्फॉर्मेशन अबाउट जामिया सो हेयर इट इज फर्स्ट ऑफकोर्स नॉट पार्ट ऑफ सी यू टी then you have okay i'm not getting into the seats and all stuff i'll rather straight away go to the aapka entrance wala jo process rahega theek hai so as you see the program code is m08 m economics ta 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 okay so the date of exam is 25th of may theek hai as they say multiple cities so of course aapke shayad jo entry centers honge wo multiple cities mein honge right so 25th of may is the date of entrance exam 
for Jamia for Masters in Economics. And of course, the timeline is 9 a.m. to 10.30, meaning 90-minute paper. That is another point. And in terms of display of the results, is 20 to 25 days. So, eight months ago, you can take the results that your results will be out, meaning in the month of June, it should be sorted. Okay? So, you all who had to ask about Jamia, so this is the date. Okay? Yeah, Kalpana, we will discuss uh, it, uh, key, which all universities you should target. And of course, IGDR and Google is already open for registration. So yeah, uh, let me just close this part. Take care for all the students who want to target Jamia. So your date of exam is 25th of May. Timing is uh, 9 to 10.30 a.m., which meaning 90 minutes. Take care. Same as your CUT ka timeline. Fourth point, uh, results in within within one month. So May hai, to June tak aapka results aa jayega, right? So and lastly about the eligibility criteria for Jamia, BA, BA honors in subject concerned with not less than fifty percent. So subject concern means economics, because you are economics ke liye apply kar rahe ho, right? And agar aap kisi aur domain se ho, then not less than fifty five percent. So na koi jhanjat I feel for maths, and it's pretty much open for all the stream students. ठीक है, so काफी open है eligibility criteria for all the students who are actually targeting Jamia, and now you have your goal set for May. Eleventh of May is your ISI, twenty fifth of May is your Jamia का paper. Okay, cool. Uh, if of course if you want a more detailed session on on Jamia, then just feel free to put it in the comment section. ठीक है, so I'll discuss the seats, the fees, the slabers, and all the stuff. In a proper session dedicated to Jamia, so only if you put it in the comment section, then I'll be able to know. And of course, you can ask it on the WhatsApp as well. Okay. So this is about Jamia. Now, of course, coming back to the universities, you can target the best university. Me, agar me, apko yaha ki jo list hai. Okay. I'll just keep it short and I'll tell you the top three options that you can target. First, of course, Delhi School of Economics. Me via Delhi University or University of Delhi, okay. So without a doubt, this is the first option. Abhi uh, and also while I'm telling you, I'll give you update as well. Iska bhi portal nahi khula hai. DU says common seat allocation system for 2025 admission. Wo abhi open nahi hua. Jaise open hoga, we'll update you. So DU ka separate registration abhi open nahi hua. It is uh, about to open in some time. Okay, so of course, first option is Delhi University. Then, if I go by via conceptual thing and the placement thing, then I would suggest IGDR at the second place. Okay, IGDR just got registration open. Ho chuka hai. Registration is open even one or two weeks post the result. So IGDR is also pretty much open. So that would be the second one. And of course, I would keep. Uh, uh, JNU, especially for the students who want to go into the civils, who want to appear for research work and uh, other stuff. So I, I would rather keep JNU as third option for all the students because it comes with legacy, good faculty, great curriculum. Of course, on a on a on a theoretical side with uh, which focuses more for students to develop a mindset for research work for government sector. So, so that that's why I'll just keep one of the options as JNU. Of course, you have University of Hyderabad as well. So, these will be the top three options that you can target, and we'll detail, we'll discuss about about some more, and what are the rational, what is the reasoning behind so and so institute job ja sakte. And lastly, of course, JNU ka bhi registration abhi open nahi hua hai. Uh, maybe in some time it should open up. Okay. So, abhi ke liye, uh, just because you asked, so I, I'll just answer. Okay. Uh, if you want to go for the eligibility criteria, so uh, here are two in economics. As you know, there are two courses they offer, SIS and SSS. Okay. I'll just pause it here. You can see the eligibility criteria for JNU, right? And I'll just open side by side for IGDR. IGDR ka, it's pretty uh, good this year because they came up with an IOS certificate as well along with the plus two wala maths. Okay. Last year because agar aap unke form mein bhi jaoge na. So it's like if you don't have maths just leave the form. Okay. 
So uh, it's pretty straightforward, right? So right on the face. So if you don't have maths, just simply move out of the form filtering. Okay. So yeah. So this is this is the eligibility criteria. If you want to pause the screen, you can pause. And we have discussed in detail about eligibility, the interview being not there and everything in our previous video for IGDA. Okay. For, uh, for JNU, we haven't discussed in detail. But of course, once the registration portal of JNU is open, we will do so. In those SIS and SSIS and courses, the major difference is that is pertaining to uh, mathematics mainly. Okay? The one requires maths, the other one doesn't exactly require maths. So they only, they only expect, right? Because if you look here, it says mathematics at the level of 12th is compulsory. So thereby they're making it mandatory for you to have it. Okay. The language changes, the wording changes, which completely changes the scenario. Knowledge of mathematics at plus two is expected. Expected hai the say we won't uh, make you ineligible for the course. This is what I expect from you as a student. But whether you know it or not, it doesn't matter, at least for our eligibility criteria. Okay? It's expected and will be tested in the entrance exam. So what they're trying to say is ki is liye bhi aapko aani chahiye because jo CUT ka paper is mein maths aayegi. So that's why it means with expected as a word, it means it is optional. And over here, it says compulsory. So it is compulsory. Okay? So for you, uh, this, is, this is something again you can take a, a screenshot or pause it. And this is for the IG there. Okay, cool. Thank you so much, guys. Go back to your work, study. It's almost like, what, 16 days left? Okay, 15, 16 days left with holy in between. So uh, it might just, uh, you'll have to take a pause, I guess. And I think a pause lena padega. If possible, usme time nikalo, it's good. But yeah, carry on with the studies. Uh, best wishes for Holi, right? And if anything in between comes up, we'll discuss that in a separate session. Thank you so much. Take care.